Hello, gamers! Meow! I present you guys with a brand new video, a possible theory, but there might be actual evidence in this video to back this theory up. And it's probably not that crazy of an idea or theory, but the theory is each character is going to have two different moveset variations. And why do I say that? So, um, I do have some screenshots and, you know, we'll have the clips from the uh, reveal trailer to go off of here. So, um, it, let me break it down real quick. Essentially, two different movesets per character are going to be based on their unique perks. Uh, so... When you have a unique perk, the way I envision this, each unique perk will be a different special move or have different capabilities of enhancing already existing special moves. So you essentially to have different these different special moves based on your perk, right? And then that could really change up how the character plays or whatever. So, for example, uh, the main one I want to focus on, well, I got a few examples here, but the first one that we'll focus on, let's go with... Excuse me. Let's uh, let's take a look at Shaggy's perk screen. So people may not uh, seen the screenshot yet, but check this out. Shaggy, as we see, we uh, we see his two unique perks. One is the sandwich icon, which is currently equipped to his character, uh, and we also see during the reveal trailer where Shaggy does end up hurling this sandwich at, I believe it's Jake, which uh, kind of makes that a very fun move, right? It uh, gives you an gives you a throwing projectile to play with to possibly snipe your opponent. All right, cool. Some people like playing with, uh, playing around with projectiles, right? So the sandwich, maybe there's other ideas that you can have. With, like it's shaggy for one. He, if there's food involved, he's going to eat it, right? So maybe a down special, if that is a, uh, a thing in this game, maybe he eats it and he heals himself or something, right? And then I don't know, every so often the sandwich can regenerate. I'm, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. And then if it's a team battle and he eats a sandwich, maybe him and his teammate both heal a uh, slight uh, percentage. Maybe that's just an idea of throwing that out there. But we also see his other perk, right? The one where it looks like he's in Ultra Instinct or the Ultra Instinct mode, that perk. We do see that in action throughout the trailer. So uh, the first one that we see is his Ultra Uppercut. Does he deliver that to Superman? I think. I'm not watching the trailer right now, but I believe he delivers it to Superman, which is more than likely going to be far more powerful and have probably more knockback. I think that, didn't they say somewhere that, or maybe didn't, they didn't. Either way, probably more power and more knockback. So, uh, and, and I could say that because as we see when he delivers that, uh, the Ultra Instinct Uppercut, we will see that his, uh, a little bit later in the, uh, towards the, I think it's towards the end of the trailer, we see him do a regular uppercut. So when he's in Ultra Instinct mode, we see that glow around his character. Now, when he delivers this regular uppercut, he's not glowing as much, and he doesn't really cover as much distance. So the Ultra Instinct part of the move, maybe it enhances his uppercut, where he jumps a little bit higher, he gets more distance, and of course, like I said, more knockback, more power. So that is a possibility for his uh, unique perks. Well, do we have any other evidence of this? Uh, well, actually, oh, wait, uh, let me back up. I was about to skip something else. We also see another Ultra Instinct move, which I believe this is kind of a big point as well. So his sandwich, which we've seen, he throws. That might be his neutral special, right? Well, what if he has the Ultra Instinct mode? What if he has that for his unique perk? What becomes his neutral special? I believe it's going to be... The wind-up punch, as we see him also deliver that to Superman, question mark? Yeah, I think it is. But we also see him deliver a big wind-up punch. That may end up being his neutral special for Ultra Instinct mode, right? Ultra Instinct, he's going to be more powerful altogether. So again, different perks, different special moves, or in Shaggy's case here, maybe it enhances other attacks that uh, are already in existence. So it's not going to be two completely separate brand new movesets, but there will be variations changes different moves altogether which again very cool idea so uh now is there any other evidence of this actually well yeah there's quite a bit we've seen uh steven uh we've seen him use his shield and his bubbles but the one i'm going to focus on is wonder woman now wonder woman what uh what 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 were her abilities now they did happen to mention during the reveal trailer her uh lasso how i can save the opponent now i'm going to imagine in a 1v1 this will probably just rope in your opponent and it'll pull, pull him towards you. I'm assuming that's how it's going to go. 
But in 2v2, it acts different and it can, well, wrangle up your teammate. So, yes, but what about her other ability? Now, again, I don't have the screenshot for uh, Wonder Woman's perks yet because we don't know for a fact, but we do see what appears to be her other unique perk in action, and that is going to be her, we'll call it the, the shield bubble? I don't know what to actually call that, but what we see is around her and around her teammate, it appears to be three of holographic uh, Wonder Woman shields. And I think they're rotating around each character. So this may act as just a shield in general. Maybe it has a property of reflecting projectiles back at the opponent, or maybe it just stops projectiles in their tracks, right where they go. So essentially you take no damage and then the shield just kind of like pops or just goes away or whatever. So it's kind of like a, all right, it protects you from one hit. Maybe it even protects you from physical hits. I, I, I don't know, I have to go back and watch the trailer, but we see two different perks, which I believe would probably be two different special attacks, maybe two different neutral specials. That's, again, guessing a little bit because we don't have 100% confirmation that this is in a, uh, her second ability, but it kind of looks like it is, so uh, I'll roll with it for now. But, uh, yeah, so two different moveset variations. If you think about it this way, right? As of right now, we have... Thir is that 13 on camera or is that 31? No, that's 31. 13. We have 13 confirmed camera. 13 confirmed cameras, no. We have 13 confirmed characters. By the official website, we know about other stuff. But 13 confirmed official characters. So if you think about it this way, say the game launches with only just those 13. There'd be people that'd be disappointed and go, 13 for base roster? Even if it's a free-to-play game, that's a low number. But when you factor in the different variations of the moves, uh, the move sets, you essentially have... 13 times 2, right? Two different unique perks for each character. You kind of, 13 times 2, you have 26 different characters to play around with. Again, probably most of the moveset will be similar between the two, but again, special moves are going to be the ones that mainly get changed based on the perk that you choose. So this could be a, this could be a really cool idea. This could be a really, really fun game. I mean, the more that we look at this game, the more that we just keep dissecting it and just finding out other information and stuff this uh, this keeps getting I just keep getting more and more excited about what this game can possibly offer uh, I really <laughs> anybody got their uh, invite yet I, I don't think they've started I don't think they st sent them out yet but anybody get their invite yet I hope they haven't got sent out because I might have got skipped over I don't want to get skipped over I really want to play this really want to play this hopefully hopefully after Thanksgiving that maybe they start sending them out because I don't think they would have announced it and then like wait for like two months and go all right now we can like you didn't need to announce it like two months in advance so i think it'll be soonish hopefully but uh yeah let me know what you guys think about this idea of move set variations per character different special moves altogether. so that is all i got for this one let me know i think i just <laughs> i just said that let me know what you guys think about this idea theory thing but uh, yeah, that is it for this one. I hope you guys enjoyed. As always, I'm excited for this game. I'm sure most of you are as well. And uh, well, I guess I'll see you when I'm looking at you.